Soybean farmers across the country are in the middle of harvest and yields are high. But U.S. Farm Bureau economist Veronica Nye says there's a major problem. We're starting to harvest this big crop and there's no place to go with them because our exports to China have basically been cut off. China hit U.S. soy imports with a 25 percent tariff amid an ongoing trade war. The lost market is leading to a backlog of the crop at storage elevators along the Mississippi River. You're now taking your crop to the elevator looking for a price and the elevator says no room at the inn. Louisiana Congressman Ralph Abraham sent a letter this week asking the U.S. Department of Agriculture to help farmers in his state. If these farmers don't harvest these beans in the next week or two or three at the most, they can literally go bankrupt. There is a federal program designed to help farmers through trade disputes, but subsidies are based on receipts from storage facilities. Full elevators means no receipts and no help for farmers. Unfortunately, we're bracing for a long um, endeavor. Abraham is asking the USDA to change how the subsidy program works and help farmers find additional storage options. But China was a crucial customer, importing 50% of soy grown in the U.S. As long as the trade war continues, experts say farmers will continue to suffer. In Washington, I'm Drew Petromo.